a crawfish. Show me how. Show me how. You stall by going to the stall. Kind of like this, but different. You go to the store, you get yourself some chore boys, all right? Now, they usually cleaning products, but you, uh, you get the chore boys, then you ask them for a Valentine's Day rose, and now it's going to be a little piece of glass, all right? And it's going to have a fake rose in it. And you're going to take them chore boys, take a little piece off, burn all the cop off of that, and you're going to stuff them down in the glass stem. You, you heard me? Next show me, show me how you eat a how you eat a crawfish. If I'm a Yankee, how do you eat a crawfish? I'll show you how I smoke crack. <laughs> okay, do we do a step by step how you eat a crawfish? First, after the char ball is in the stem, then you're gonna want to put the little rock in. Then you're gonna want you're gonna want to hold it upwards because it's still solid. All right, and then next thing you do, you hold it up and you put that lighter not on it. But you put it just so it's barely touching and melting that rock, right? So you start out like this, but once you hear that sizzle and it starts melting, <laughs> and it's gonna make a crackling sound while you do it. Then you're gonna hold that in as long as possible. And the next thing you know, you're gonna be hearing in your mind that song. Everybody know this song, it's a good song. What is it? Ring my bell, <laughs> ring my bell, crack rock, you go ring. You know, it's one of those type of things. Mama taught me that. Well, actually, one of Mama's boyfriends that she fucked to get me into school taught me that. But <laughs> for what it's worth, I started using profanity after my mama did, which was shortly after they filmed a documentary about our family. She went, she went to heaven when I was four.